In this video, we will showcase a real case study of a glass production line that utilizes recycled materials. Join us as we explore the process of manufacturing PV glass in an environmentally sustainable way. There is a significant number of damaged or inefficient solar panels in need of replacement and recycling. We will explore the process of recycling these solar panels to produce high-quality solar glass. These glasses were recycled from used solar panels. They were procured from the market, stored at the raw material yard, and subsequently transported to the glass furnace. After going through the entire production line, they were transformed into high-quality glass. These recycled glasses are collected from the production line, which include trimmed glasses from the cut-to-order process and unqualified glasses from the sorting process. Along with the glasses recycled from used solar panels mentioned earlier, they will be transported via a conveyor belt to the glass furnace for melting and refining together. These silicon oxide materials are also used for glass manufacturing. They are new materials, in contrast to the recycled materials. To produce new glasses, we blend these silicon oxide materials with recycled glasses to achieve cost-effectiveness and promote a better environment. To ensure high-quality glasses, we maintain a maximum limit of 30% recycled material in the mixture. With a comprehensive understanding of the various raw materials used in glass manufacturing, let's now embark on a detailed exploration of the entire production line. The first step in the process is melting and refining. The ingredients are mixed in the right proportion and the entire batch is flown into a furnace heated to 1,500 degrees Celsius, which equals to 2,732 degrees Fahrenheit. The second step in the process is float bath. The molten material from the furnace flows into the float bath, consisting of a mirror-like surface made from molten tin. This material enters the bath at 1,500 degrees Celsius and leaves the bath at around 650 degrees Celsius. Its shape at the exit is like a solid ribbon. The third step in the process is coating for reflective glass. By adding a reflective coating, Sunlight is diffusely reflected onto the glass, increasing the efficiency of solar panels. The fourth step in the process is annealing. It is done to remove the internal stresses built up in the glass. This process allows the glass ribbon to pass through a layer that eliminates any pressures on the glass surface and gradually cools it to give it its final hardened form. This makes it easier to cut the glass and shape it accordingly. The fifth step in the process is the initial cutting. During this stage, the glass is cut and shaped to facilitate subsequent steps in the process.
The sixth step in the process is inspecting. It's done to identify air bubbles, stresses, or grains of sand that refuse to melt. This is essential in quality proofing the final form of glass. The seventh step in the process is cutting to order. Diamond steel tools are utilized to trim and cut the glass ribbons into square shapes and sizes as specified by the order requirements. The trimmed glass is then collected to a recycling bin and transported to the glass furnace using a conveyor system. It is recycled as part of the raw materials used in glass manufacturing, as mentioned earlier in this video. The eighth step in this process is sorting. Based on the results of the previous inspection, the qualified glass panels are sent for packaging. The unqualified glass panels are directed to the recycling bin and then transported via a conveyor belt system to the glass furnace, as mentioned in the beginning of the video. The ninth and final step in this process is recycling, which takes place in a dedicated recycling facility connected to the main production line building via an overpass. Magnetic sorting is employed during this stage to remove any magnetic materials present in the recycled glasses. Following the recycling process, all recycled glasses are mixed with silicon oxide and transported to the melting stage. These are all the processes involved in glass manufacturing, which heavily relies on a significant amount of recycled glasses. As a result, we recognize the business potential in recycling glasses from solar panels. Don't hesitate to contact us for further details and information regarding this opportunity.